save the ladybug. Isn't that right? So I'm going to put the ladybug somewhere else where I'm not going to mow. She came off the machine. She was in the long grass. There you go. Come on, lady. Come on. Oh, God. Shook her into the grass then. So now I'm topping this field because we've got a pretty massive um, big thistle population. So you can see I'm going to be mowing and topping all of that and munching it into the soil or rather munching it into the grass. this now we've got to get untwist that I was driving too fast it's very thick in there so okay ladies you can see how high the thistles are okay you guys can stay there there you can see the swathe we've mulch mode got to turn that down disengage that so it's very thick stuff. It's also very wet still. So, but I don't want this to become a field of monocropped thistles. So I'm gonna have to reduce its numbers. And this is what you do. What is it? The old saying, cut in May, you double the display. Cut in June, you've cut too soon. Cut in July, watch them die. We have too big a patch of thistles for my farm to support viably. We're not the Napa State, we're a very small acreage. So I need high biodiversity, but not patches of thistle this big. So now I have to untwist you can see this is what's happened is it's twisted around the blade everything's off so I can reach in and pull the uh, binding grass up because it just got too heavy for the machine and I just have to go slower now is what I have to do so this is uh, what I will probably have to do a few times I don't have a tractor. I only have this quad one mower. If I had a tractor, I would have a bigger horsepower machine than this. But this is only a, what is it? It's an 18 horsepower motor. So it's not hugely strong. So there's my, uh, it's me and the girls. The boys just don't bother coming. Brindle's in the shade over there. So I'm gonna keep going at this now, pulling, unraveling this grass and that's binding up the blades and continue on. Went too fast again. <laughs> 